In just two months, police have been called to Southwest Early College campus 50 times. That's right. The district is looking for new leadership now after the principal suddenly resigned. Larry Seward is live in Brookside with more on the problems at the school. Hey, Larry. Hi, Elizabeth. Uh, teachers just concluded about an hour-long meeting with their union president and superintendent, Dr. John Covington, who introduced the new principal here at SWEC. Steve Scraggs was principal at Southwest Early College campus for four years. This summer, he was optimistic about the school's future, despite tripled enrollment caused by a forced merger with Westport. Now he's out. He resigned Friday. Neither he nor district officials would comment, but sources say Scraggs left for personal reasons. People in the community wonder if growing discipline problems are to blame. I think it's just too many students in the building for one pimp principal. It's a disaster. Last month, Superintendent Dr. John Covington opened an alternative program at Manual Tech, largely because of fights and disruptions at SWEC. Still, teachers, staff, and neighbors say serious safety concerns remain. In emails, they report two fires last week, kids smoking pot in neighbors' yards, kids having sex on cars, and recording video of sex in bathrooms. John Murphy lives nearby. He's frustrated. There's no supervision. Kids are roaming the streets. We've been calling over to the school and to the district to have these kids truant kids brought back in the classroom and sit down and learn and the um, and the administration refuses to to follow up on any of our calls i don't think they were prepared. Fifi Weideman works with a neighborhood group that hung this banner over Sweck's front door and organized support for the school. She says district officials seem uninterested in accepting help. Some believe that kind of support or lack thereof led to Scraggs' resignation. And several times today we tried calling Mr. Steve Scraggs unsuccessfully in each of those cases. We also tried to engage the district officials, but they declined comment because they're planning a press conference to announce all of these changes tomorrow sometime. And again, after the end, at the end of this teachers meeting today, we were told that the principal who is currently serving at Manual Tech, which is an alternative program, is going to move here to SWEC and become the new principal here. That all will be announced sometime tomorrow. At 6, you'll hear from parents and their reaction to yet another transition for them here at SWEC. We're live in Brookside. Larry Seward, NBC Action News.